Okay, we have a field here that has some problem areas we're going to deal with. Uh, the first one of them being is that we have uh, erosion in these focal points between these two hills where water flows through. Uh, there, as you can see by the satellite imagery, that we're getting a little bit of erosion here. We want to fix that. Uh, and to do that, we have taken and built a custom design, custom area around that point. We go over here to this custom area, and I just did a max rate of change on the cross slope, 1 over 25, so it can only fall side slope going right to left, 1 foot in 25 feet. And what that has done, it has uh, really smoothed out those that hill in that point that's really the only thing we've done is is smooth those hills out so we can see by our cut fill map that uh, pretty much cutting this hill off and dumping it in these lows here and smoothing that out so when we finish with that take and go back to our proposed map here so when we get finished with that, we go down here to uh, import field as a new design and hit click OK and that's going to export that proposed surface out as a new field. So here is that uh, field, that design iteration that we exported out so it already has our uh, hills fixed up for our erosion problem in it already and now we just need to fix the drainage issues so we have uh, some drainage issues right here this is just this area here does not flow out good and so we'll take and go in here we just take in uh, told that we wanted a, a minimum slope of three tenths to the field and so we ran that calculation and here's what we came up with the design is let's get a little better definition here uh, all this will flow out just fine there look at our flow paths um, coming through there and all that water flow right out of there next thing that we had to deal with was right through here coming into the field from under this road was a 24 inch pipe and that water was flowing down through this field here and creating erosion problems as well so to deal with that we're going to take and design us a little dam across here, build a little catch basin, and then we'll put in an underground 24 inch pipe all the way underneath the surface here to dump out into this creek that goes through here. So none of that water will actually run across the field anymore. It'll come into this catch basin and get shot through that pipe. Uh -oh. So to design that uh, little dam across there to create that catch basin, I just use the ditch tool and drew in my line. And then you just go in here and I just did a 3D design for that there. Put the slope constraints at zero and then I went in here and locked one of these nodes to a set elevation so that top of that road or dam is going to be that 754 elevation all the way across there because there's no slopes in there so what that has done is created a little nice little dam there take it in 3d view you can see it 
right there. It's going to catch that water and uh, deal with it quite nicely. Um, show you a little bit of the surface. So there's our finished field. This water is going to drain off very nicely uh, right here. Uh, we have fixed our focal points on our rolling heels up here. Made that in a lot smoother transition. There won't be a focal point for water. And we have created us a nice little catch basin here to catch that water coming underneath the road from the other side, that 24 inch pipe. And then once we get all of that done, we have to go back and compare it to the original surface. So we come down here to, uh, since we've done several design iterations, we have to go back and get us an original cut fill yardage and stuff. We go down here to compare design surface and uh, select our original field and hit compare and wait for it to come. Okay, the calculation is finished here. We're comparing the field back to the original survey. So we get a true cut field yardage as well as a true cut field map. And here we have it. Um, our cut field map and our yardage is down here. We have a total moved of 7,800 yards on 52 acres, 149 yards per acre, which is not bad. We're cutting off this hill. We're filling in these two focal points here where you're having some erosion. We've created a little dam for a catch basin to catch that water that comes across the road, dam it up and drop it through a subsurface pipe down here to the creek. And we have filled in some drainage areas issues right here so they flow out well as well as filling in this uh, ditch or wash that this water has created over the years through here. So taking that field and fixed up some drainage issues, fixed up some erosion issues, and built a little catch basin uh, with several design iterations in WM form.